got here is the Arbor Shreddy Kruger. It's a full rocker board, a little more rocker kind of towards the middle and then a little mellower towards the tips and tails. But anytime you have a rocker board like this, it's going to be good and pow. It doesn't have as short of a tail as some of the other powder boards, so you're going to have a really stable platform to pop your ollies off. But it does have that V cut into it. It's going to help you sink in there and keep the nose up. Also, as you can tell, it's got definitely a bit of a longer nose, so that'll help you float. One thing that's nice about this board with a little bit of the longer tail is it gives you a bit of platform to land on as well. So you have something back there to hold you up if you start wheeling or anything. This isn't a super wide board, so it's just going to knife through the powder, going to be super responsive edge to edge. Kind of rides in some ways more like a traditional board, but with a little more float thanks to that setback rocker they have in there. Right by your inserts on either side here, it's got these little bumps that pop out. That's their grip tech edges. It's not going to help you a lot in pow, but when you hit that hard pack again, you're really going to appreciate that. This is a medium flex board, so it's still going to be nice and responsive when you need it. When you're riding anything out, if you hit any chunder, it's going to handle that all right too. The nice thing about this board is it's not just powder specific. You're going to be able to ride it all over the mountain and it'll perform just fine. So this is the Arbor Shreddy Kruger. Set it back a little bit and point it.